Well, I'm going to build myself another log trailer. I'm actually going to modify my, uh, my utility trailer here. My last log trailer went under there. I used the frame to build my little sawmill. Now I have this old buzz saw, cordwood saw, whatever you guys want to call it. So I'm just converting my utility trailer into a four foot log trailer. Now, uh, I got some of this old pipe here. So I just cut a, in the process of cutting pieces, I cut that piece and I welded it on there. So my pipe, pipe will slide into there. I have to cut another one, weld it over there. And it won't interfere with my racks either. I can still put my racks back on later and use it. But, uh, that's how she be. Anyway, I'm going to weld another piece on there. First I have to cut a piece and then I'm going to weld it on there. But, uh, our store here don't open till 11 o'clock on a Sunday. And it's, uh, it's about 20 to 11. So, uh, I'm just going to fiddle around here a little bit. And see what I can do. I need gas for the old welder getting low I don't want to start and run it because it'll just end up uh, getting water into the fuel so uh, anyway I'll add some fuel to that and then I'll, I'll uh, start welding another piece on and then I'll put some air in that tire sharpen my old chainsaw up and I might uh, head into the bush today and get myself a load of dry pine so uh, well stick around the tractor around and I'm ready to go out uh, welding the other piece on so uh, I'll find a place to set this big bad camera here and uh... hmm oh, how about that you see that okay that'll be okay I'll start this little welder up here
let uh, pockets welded on there. So I'm just going to weld a couple bands around those pipes so they don't slide all the way down. And uh, cut them to length and uh, I'm good to go. I'll be going to the bush soon. So I got my pickets all cut to the right length here, the proper length. I uh, welded these little guys on here so it can only go down so far when I drop them in the pickets. Bang, they stay there. They're down in about five inches. So hopefully they don't bounce out on me. So it's 10 feet long. If I go four feet high, um, four feet high by four feet wide, that's uh, three 16 inch blocks to every four foot. That's three 16 inch blocks yeah, to every four foot piece. So eight feet long by four feet high would give me three cords, three 16 inch face cords of firewood. So uh, I'm hoping for three and a half, uh, maybe three and three quarters of a, a cord pile on here once, once I'm done. So uh, I'm just gonna trim up the front racks a little bit to make them look a little neater. Um, someday I will put uh, steel pickets on the front there too. And I can remove these pickets too at the back when I put my side racks on so it doesn't interfere too much. And maybe later I will build a, build a gate that folds down that just slides into these round pockets at the back for future use. So uh, anyway, that's it for now guys. You take care. Uh, have a good day. Check out some of my other videos if you if you find this one interesting. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, please. Take care. Bye-bye.